Today's topic is coronary cannulation through right or left radial route for diagnostics and interventions, tips and tricks. To understand this, you need to understand the anatomy of the passage and you must have a clear cut comparison of both passages that is femoral and radial in mind. If you are working through femoral root, it is a very straight passage and there is only one point of resistance when uh, the catheter curves through the arch and enters the ascending aorta. If you are working through right radial, there is one point of resistance at this junction and the other again when it turns at the ascending aorta. If you are working through left radial, it is almost like the femoral. There is only one point of resistance here and you straight away enters the ascending aorta. If you have this clarity in mind, the things become easy. Normally, for diagnostics, more than 98% of the times we are done with a single catheter that is Terumo Tiger catheter available in 5 French size. Whether we are working through the right radial or left radial. Whether we are cannulating the left coronary or right coronary. The left coronary cannulation is pretty easy once you are in the ascending aorta. Put the catheter down and just pull it back. Most of the times it engages the, the left. For engaging the right coronary you have to push the catheter down. Normally what I do is I will rotate it you know clockwise and most of the times it goes in. If it goes on flipping then slowly clock counter clock, clock counter clock, a slow movement it, it is helpful. And many times this doesn't work particularly when there are anatomical problems in this region. You rotate it clockwise or counter clockwise it is almost always good to work through femoral but here if it doesn't work through radial because of the resistance because of the anatomical issues in the subclavian region what you need to do is forget about clock or counter clock just have your eye on the tip of the catheter and rotate it properly in such a way that it goes in a proper direction and don't bother about clock or counter clock rotation it is like playing video games you know you develop your hand eye coordination which can be very very helpful to you believe me it will work wonders for you for sometimes the the tiger catheter does not work in that case you can use the left and right Judkins catheter separately and cannulate sometimes the left Judkins also fails to cannulate if the root is very dilated and distorted and there, I need to give you a tip. In your lab, if you have 5 French extra backup or Voda guiding catheter, 5 French, you use it, whether it is EBU or XB, and it works wonders. Most of the times, it will cannulate your left. Anomalous coronary origin, actually, my experience is, it is easy to cannulate the anomalous whether it is left or right coronary working through the radial as compared to working through the femoral and most of the times with the regular catheters you can work for right if the regular right Jetkins does not work for the angioplasty right amplars can be a great catheter and very rarely we use left amplars catheter to cannulate the right even for cannulation of the left my practice is usually to avoid left amplas unless it is absolutely compelling because of very dilated root. Most of the cases I am done with the extra backup guide whether it is 3.5 or 3 or at times 4 and sometimes with the left Jetkins uh, guiding catheter. I discussed my strategy of cannulating the left and right coronaries through the right radial root. Now what is the difference if you have to work through the left radial root and cannulate the left and right coronary arteries? As I told, told you in the beginning of my talk, 
that anatomically the femoral region and the left radial region are the same. There is only one point of resistance. So all those catheters which are good to be used through femoral are to have to be equally good to be used through the left radial. Sometimes the tiger does not work well through the left radial for diagnostic and Judkins almost invariably, left and right Judkins will almost invariably work. Even extra backup guide, you don't find any problem working through the left radial. Even the Amplards guide works better through the left radial if you are using Amplards through the left radial. And this is all what I wanted to convey you. Thanks.